We are a family of pygmy three-toed sloths that live on a small island in the jungle of Panama. My family consists of my mom, my big sister, and I. My mom told me there's not many sloths like us on our island. There are these trees called red mangrove trees that we love so much. We only leave them to go to the forest floor once a week. My three curved claws and all of my feet help me hang from branches and climb around in these awesome trees. Thankfully, I don't have to move down from the trees when I go to sleep. When we are sleeping, my family and I use our strong claws to hang from branches. Us sloths like to sleep for very long periods of time to regain our energy that is spent away when we are active. When we are awake, we love to munch on plenty of leaves from these trees by hanging upside down from our bottom feet. I've become quite a pro at it. My mom told me we move very slowly to make sure not to use up all of our energy too quickly. Being slow could be a bad thing at times, however. Being so slow makes it easier for other creatures, like the harpy eagle, to catch us. Sometimes we can scare them away with our claws. However, this is not even our biggest concern for living in the peace and comfort of our beautiful trees. We have been noticing that there are fewer trees for us to climb on and to eat from. The people who come around our homeland like to chop down our trees. They do this to make room for their own homes. I notice I have less space to put with my sister with how many trees there are. There are also less playmates to play with because they've become sick from the few amount of leaves to eat. There isn't a single sloth I know who likes to live, sleep, or play in the ground. If we had a larger home filled with lots of red mangrove trees, we'd be able to roam further and eat all the leaves we want. I bet that there would eventually be more sloths to play with too. At least I have my big sister. To help with their red mangroves, Humans should stop chopping down our trees so the trees can drop their seeds and new ones can grow. An island full of sloths like me? That's hard to imagine, but that would be amazing.